Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can convert from text to speech using Python. We are going to achieve this using a package called GTTS, which stands for Google Text to Speech Package. So GTTS or Google Text to Speech is a Python library and a command line tool also to interface with Google Translate's text to speech API. So let's get started and let's see how we can convert from text to speech using this GTTS package. So first of all, you need to have the latest version of Python installed on your operating system. So let's check for the Python version first of all. So I'm going to open the terminal and I'm going to just type uh, Python hyphen hyphen version and then press enter. And if you see some output like this, in my case, the latest version is Python 3.7.4 at the time of making this video. So once you verify that uh, this version is shown on your terminal, Python is installed on your system. You just need to check one more thing, which is pip is installed on your system or not. By default, whenever you install Python, pip comes packaged with the Python executable. So you don't need to install pip uh, in any extra way. Pip is the Python package manager. So just type pip and then type my hyphen hyphen version and then press enter and it's going to show you the version of pip which is available for your Python. So pip 19.0.3 is available for my Python 3.7. So if you see this kind of output and this kind of output, you are ready to go. So the first thing is to install the GTTS package using the pip package manager. So to do that, I'm going to just type pip install and then type GTTS. Okay, and then press enter, which is going to start installing this GTTS package on your Windows operating system or any other operating system you are working on. And after some time, you will see this message, which will say something like successfully installed this, this, this package on your Windows operating system, which includes this GTTS package also. So once this package is installed, we are ready to develop our Python script. So let's say I want to develop my Python script inside this work folder. I have Visual Studio Code, so I can open uh, this Visual Studio Code and then uh, start creating uh, my Python script. You can use any other editor. So let's create uh, this uh, test.py file or let's say this will be our uh, text underscore to speech dot py file and then press enter to create this file. And once this file is created, we can just uh, start typing our code. So once you have a GTTS package, you will be able to import it using your Python script. So just write from GTTS import G capital TTS. Also, we are going to import the OS package, which is available by default on your Python uh, uh, package. And now we are going to start uh, writing some uh, text. So we are going to just uh, declare a variable called my text for example and then you can provide some text here for example text to speech conversion using python now in the next step we are going to define the language in which we want to create our audio file so obviously our text is in english so i'm going to define a variable called language so for the english support you just need to write en here for the french support you can write fr here or any other code which is supported by gtts so for example, we just need to add the English language support. So just write EN. And then in the next line, we are going to pass our language and our text to the GTTS engine. So let's say we are going to define uh, the variable called uh, output first of all. And then we will call uh, this GTTS, which we have imported using the GTTS package. And this uh, class takes few arguments first argument will be the text. So you can just write text is equal to your text variable, which is my text. 
the second argument will be the language so i'm going to just say lang is equal to your language variable so this is our language variable also i'm going to pass this variable called slow which i'm going to set it to a false value so let's set it to a false uh, value this means that we want our audio to be played in high speed not in a slow speed that's why we have set slow is equal to false now once you have uh, this output you can save this into the form of a mp3 file so let's uh, use our output uh, variable and then you can call a method called save here so you can call this method called save and then you can define the name of your file here so for example i want to name my audio file as output dot mp3 which is going to create an mp3 file in the same folder in which you are working in and then in the next line we are going to play our mp3 file using the default program so for this you can use the os module so just write os dot system and then in the parenthesis you can uh, just write start so just write start and the name of your file which you want to start so the name of my file is output dot mp3 so the start space the name of the file is going to start your mp3 file using the default program which is supported on your windows operating system or any other operating system so that's it so this is the script to convert your text into the speech and then convert it into an audio file which is the mp3 file so let's try to run this code now let me open the terminal which is available inside my visual studio code so we will be able to see this output at the same time while the script is running so here i'm going to just type inside the same folder in which i'm working in python and the name of my script which is text to speech.py and then i'm going to press enter and in some time you will see this output.mp3 file is created here and then it's going to be opened using the default app text to speech conversion using python now let's say you want to convert a text file into an mp3 file this is also easy using this gtts uh, package so let me just close this terminal and this time let's say we just want to read the file and then uh, just convert into an mp3 file so instead of using this my text variable let's define a variable called fh for file handler and then there is a default method inside python which is called open which is used to uh, open and read the files so here you just need to give the name of your uh, file so let's say we have a file called test.txt this file we are going to create in some seconds so this will be the name of the file the second argument here will be the mode so the mode will be r for read if you write w here then it's a write mode and if you write uh, r here then it's a read mode now in the next line what i'm going to do is i'm going to declare this my text uh, variable for my text and then i'm going to just say fh dot read this is the function to read your uh, text and then i'm going to replace all the line endings because in the text there might be line endings which uh, this uh, gtts module might not be able to read them so i'm going to replace all the line endings with the replace function and then i'm going to just say i want to replace all the line endings with the space okay so once you have this my text this variable name is same as the old variable name so we don't need to change uh, this variable here also after you have uh, done uh, reading your file at the end of your script you can also close your file handler so you can just call a function called uh, close on your 
fh variable it's a good practice to close all your file handlers once you are done using them okay so now the only thing remains is the creation of test.txt file so let's create this test.txt file so i have uh, this uh, gtts uh, web page open here i'm going to just put the link in the description also so i'm going to just uh, copy this content from here and paste it into my file okay so you can uh, see this is the text which i want to convert and let's run our script so i'm going to open a new terminal and here i'm going to just type uh, python text to speech dot py and then press enter which is going to create this output file once again gtts google text to speech a python library and cli tool to interface with google translate a circumflex euro s text to speech api write spoken mp3 data to a file a file like object byte string for further audio manipulation so that's it for this video this is how you can convert your text to speech using gtts module in python i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next video